Maine is in a unique position. We have an exceptional population, a workforce that's developing, and a work ethic that puts us at the head of our region. We've also faced challenges. We face challenges in a changing economy, reduced opportunities in manufacturing, and economic challenges for the state budget. These opportunities we have are associated with our unique geography and our unique people. Tidal energy fits in to the long-term energy portfolio of Maine. There's no one solution for our energy challenges in Maine. It's not going to be offshore wind, it's not going to be terrestrial wind, it's not going to be tidal energy. What it is, is it's a portfolio of, of energy solutions that will build up our future in Maine. Tidal energy is the jumping off point to ocean energy in Maine. We have the opportunity with tidal energy to develop an industry that has no better opportunities anywhere in the United States. We have our rugged coastline which provides more tidal energy sites than any other location than any other state in the 48 contiguous states. At the same time we have the opportunity to build the skills in the people of Maine. These skills are being demonstrated by ORPC in Eastport and will be moved down the coast into the other projects that we're looking at in West Cassett and south in Maine. These tidal energy sites have the potential to reduce costs for communities, provide community energy at an affordable price. These are not projects that depend on grid connection. These are projects that can immediately benefit towns. That's the idea behind the municipal option. The municipal option was exercised in Wiscasset and our goal in the next phase of Department of Energy funding would be to look at the Wiscasset site, assess the value of the resource, and work with the community and Chuanki Foundation to identify the size and opportunities in that location. Island communities also have the same resource. Tidal energy is unique in that we can predict the time at which we will receive the energy and we can also use various storage techniques to provide um, energy that would work for base load as well as peaking capacity within the community. We appreciate the support, the ongoing support, and we look forward to extending this beyond the current uh, participants. That includes Ocean Renewable Power Company, Zipiac Energy, the Passamaquoddy Pleasant Point Reservations Energy LLC, and the Tidal Energy Device Evaluation Center in Castine.